Hey, and welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download mega files without a limit. And there's going to be a couple tools that we'll need to get started. The first one is XDM, which is Extreme Download Manager. And the second one is Mega Downloader. Now, Mega Downloader is a popular tool out there, but the version that we actually need is version 1.8. And we specifically need this one because we want to be able to capture a URL for streaming. And that's one of the methods that we're going to be using right now to get started. If you go to our website, we have a blog post that we put it up here. We put some links in for both of the download manager and the mega downloader. And you can really use any download manager. You don't have to use the extreme download manager. You can use IDM or whatever uh, manager you'd like. We're just gonna be using this one for as an example. Mega downloader version 1.8, which we have here. We're specifically saying this version. Now you can get this anywhere online, but you have to be careful about the one that you're getting because many of them have malware and Trojans embedded in it. The link is in the description below. You can go ahead and click on those and get them downloaded and we'll get started right now. So we're gonna click on the link here for Extreme Download Manager, and it's gonna take us to the GitHub website, the homepage for this uh, tool. And so this is the homepage, and it's a very, it's just the link at the top, downloads, click on it. We're gonna be downloading the version for Windows, which is the MSI installer. And once it downloads, we can go ahead and click on that, and it'll immediately install on your PC. Now, once it's loaded up, it's gonna be in the system tray in the bottom right-hand corner of your uh, Windows desktop where the clock is. If we click on the XDM or Extreme Download Manager icon, it'll automatically load and you'll see it on your desktop. So the second piece that we're going to install is the Mega Downloader version 1.8. So we'll click on the link and it'll take us to the download page and we can just simply click on download and it's going to download the file on our computer. So we'll just skip ahead to where we already have it downloaded. And in our downloads folder, we can find the icon and the setup file. We can just double click on that and it's going to launch into the installation window. So the wizard will pop up here in just a second. Uh, it wants to allow access. We can say yes to this. And so for the setup, we're going to select English and hit OK. And the default folder will be fine. We're going to be using default settings for all of this. So we'll click on next. The folder name will be fine and the shortcuts will be leaving as is. We'll click on next and we'll click on install and allow it to install through here. Uh, once complete, we can leave it checked and click on finish and it's going to launch the mega downloader application. So those are the two applications that we need installed and now we can start configuring. Now, the first thing that we're going to do, click on options that go down to configurations and inside the configuration window, we want to look for streaming. We're going to click on this and under streaming configurations, we want to make sure that we check use streaming server, click on save. And then you get a, might get a prompt here. You just have to click on allow access. And it shows us that everything is saved successfully. Now we can go over to our browser and get the file that we want to download. We have a very large file here, 4.86 gigs. Uh, one huge file is the name of it. Uh, what we want to do is go up to the address bar and copy the link here by clicking on it and copy. Now automatically Mega Downloader wants to download it. We're going to just close this because we're not actually going to use this portion. And what we're going to do now is we're going to go into the streaming menu and watch online. Then we're going to paste the link in here where Mega URL is and we get a streaming URL link. Now this is actually what we want. We want to highlight this, click on it and copy it. Now we're going to go over to our extreme download manager, open that up, go up to the file menu at the top and then add URL. Now it's might automatically populate it, but if not, we just paste it in there. And we want to make sure that the folder that we um, are downloading into is the destination folder that you want. We have it as downloads. So we can go ahead and keep that the way it is. And then we're going to click on the download now link at the bottom. The file is now going to download onto your computer. And that is the last step. With this process, it does not matter the file type or file size that you're going to be using. 
This is how you can download uh, any file with no limits with Mega Downloader. Um, this method has been successful with many users. I hope it's successful for you as well. If you have any problems, put them in the comments below and I'll try to answer them as best as I can. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give us a like. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.